In this video, we will talk about some notations we use when we divide numbers. Then we will talk about division that involves zero. Let's say that we want to divide 6 by 3. Then we can write 6 divided by 3 equals 2. Another notation is 6 divided by 3 equals 2. We can also write that 6 divided by 3 equals 2. We can also divide these numbers using a fraction bar and we can write that 6 divided by 3 equals 2. In any of these examples, 6 is the dividend, 3 is the divisor, and 2 is the quotient. We know that the division is the reverse operation of multiplication and the division can be checked by using multiplication. So, if 6 divided by 3 equals 2, then 3 multiplied by 2 will give us 6. So, we can write that 3 multiplied by 2 equals 6. Now, let's talk about division that involves 0. In the first example, we will divide 0 by a number. We will divide 0 by 5. 0 divided by any non-zero number is 0. And that is because if we take 5 and if we multiply it by 0, the result will be 0. So again, 5 multiplied by 0 equals 0. So we can divide 0 by any non-zero number and the result will always be 0. Now let's divide 5 by 0. What is 5 divided by 0? If we multiply 0 by this number, the result should be 5. But we know that 0 times any number is 0. So again, 0 multiplied by this unknown number is 0. So we can't divide a non-zero number by 0, and we will say that 5 divided by 0 is undefined. Now, what about dividing 0 by 0? So, let it be an unknown number. And now, if we multiply 0 by this unknown number, we should get 0. In this case, this can be any number, because 0 times any number will be 0. So, 0 times any number will be 0. Then we say that 0 divided by 0 is indeterminate. Now, let's review again all these three cases. 0 divided by a non-zero number is 0. A non-zero number divided by 0 is undefined. And 0 divided by 0 is indeterminate. I hope you enjoyed the video and thank you for watching.